Hello everybody, it's Sword Song, and I'm going to play Mad Father. I played a little bit the other day, but um, my recording was all weird and stuff, so I have to redo it. So, I know a little bit of what I'm getting into at this point. Uh, honestly, I know a little bit about the game um, from previous stuff, because it's Mad Father. It's a pretty well-known title. It's obviously a uh, RPG maker horror game. But... You know, I wanted to play it for myself also. It's kind of an experiment. I've got a lot of new software and stuff on my computer that I am messing around with. A uh, new screen capture program, stuff like that, that I'm trying to see what I can do with. So, this seems like a good thing to do. It's pretty, pretty good game from what I know, and it's uh, pretty easy on my computer to run it. So I can run it and have it going and, and not completely crash everything out while I'm doing it. So... Let's do this. I really love the music. It's just so great. It's kind of relaxing. I also have a new mic that I'm going to try and get up and running eventually right now. I've been fighting with that, so right now I'm still using the headphone mic, but hopefully I can get rid of this sooner rather than later. So... Mad Father. Okay. I hit a button, so the song just came to an end. Northern Germany, Drevis Residence. Hello? Father? Father, are you in there? Father! I wasn't expecting you. Aya, how many have I... How many times have I told you not to come down here? Uh, not enough. Sorry, Father. But, um, I'm too scared to sleep on my own. Aya. Uh, don't worry. You're never alone. Your late mother is always there at your side. She's always looking after you, Aya. Uh. Okay, now please, go back to bed. Yes, Father. Good girl. Bad. How old am I? Father, tomorrow's... Yes, the anniversary of her death. We'll visit her grave together. Okay. Now go back to bed. Please, I'll be resting too shortly. Okay. Like, how- I don't feel like I should have heels on. I feel like I'm a little girl, and that's really bad for her. Stop. It's no good. No! Oh! Help me, help! Oh, it's not good. I forgot about that. I know I said I played some yesterday, but the chainsaw thing. Just... I know father's secret. My father is a scientist. He loves research and is always locked up in the lab in the basement. And I've always heard things from that lab. Animal and human screams. Even at a young age, I knew what my father was doing. So I pretended I wasn't looking. That I didn't know or hear anything. I feigned ignorance the whole time. Because I love Father. That's not the only secret I know. When Mom and I weren't around, he and his helper. Ooh, umber. A fine sample. I shall dispose of the remaining materials myself. Good, do that. That can wait. Come, Maria. Doctor. Buh. Which creepy alien eyes. Doctor. She's aware of our relationship. Hmm. What does it matter? I don't believe she's fond of me. That is the problem. The girl will be 11 soon. It's a, trouble it's a troublesome age to be sure. Be kind to her, please. Make sure she is never harmed. She is my most precious. That's a weird way to say that. Okay. Well, uh, okay. That happened. It's the world's slowest clock. Talk. Tick. Talk. It's midnight. Today's the day Mom went to heaven. Mom. Yep. I can never sleep when I think about Mom. Can you not make weird noises? Oh, look. Bunny. Snowball. I'm gonna call it Angel Bunny, because I'm a brony. 
Where is the traitor? The red-eyed stranger. Whoa. Huh? Something fell out. Take it. Get it. Get it good. It's a shiny thing. Miss Frizz, you got a sparkly. Gems are hidden in various places. Some require doing special events to get. You can get. You can see your gem count on the menu. Find them all and ellipses. The Dark Quartet. These sound like really great books. My favorite teddy bear. My favorite teddy bear is a koala. I will put a picture at the end so you can see her. A beloved doll. She is so old and beat up. My koala. A doll I got from father. It's so old and worn. Ooh, flashback. Sorry, my computer's set up kind of precarious, so like when I touch it, it tilts. Hopefully I can get that fixed. I bought you bra- I brought- uh, <coughs> Yay, it's a doll! With my scruffy mop head. Thank you, father. What a pretty doll. It's almost like it's real. I don't want no dolls that are real. There's a thing called an uncanny valley. Real dolls are firmly in that valley. Don't want it. Okay, cool. Awesome. A portrait of mom. Mom. Damn. Mom's fine. <laughs> what should I do, mom? I do love father, but he's creepy. Oh, she scares me. She's always looking at me with those eyes. Have you seen those eyes? She's got the giant, but I know father likes her. She's got, like, gray eyes. I don't want her to be my new mom. I don't need a new mom. There's only one mom in the world for me. Mom, why did you have to go? She had a blood disease. That's the repo. Repo reference. I've been spotted. Oh. The room feels cold all of a sudden. I'm kind of scared. I should get back to bed. Yeah, let's do it. Get back. Or just go in a circle. I am, I am so competent. <laughs> get in the bed. <laughs> Good night. Cool. I'm climbing from the foot of the bed. I do that. My bed's set up in a way that, like, it's, it's like, you know, I have a middle room, and so you can get to all edges. So sometimes I'll just climb in the, what is that? Oh, it's a creepy girl singing green sleeves. You think you could possibly be singing Samara's Lullaby from The Ring? That might work. You sing so well, and creepy. I'm gonna put a recording of your voice in a haunted house, Aya. Father, would you look this way? Look this way! Just put this here. Ooh, he's making arts. Arts and crafts with Aya's father. Yes, it's finished! A flower crown? What are you, stupid? Does it look good on me? Yes, I think it suits you well. Yay! Thank you, father. I'm sorry I can't always play with you. Father, don't be a downer. We're having a good day. It's all right. I'm glad I could play with you today, father. I, when I was little, I called my mom and dad, mom and dad, or mommy and daddy. I never said mother and father. Like, this, she's an uptight little girl. Mom! Look, father made me a flower crown. That's wonderful. It looks great on you, Aya. It's damn skippy. So you played with him all day? Yeah. What was he doing? Not bringing home the bacon. Yes, we should. Next time, your mother should join in. Well, I look forward to it. Cough hack! Mom! I'm sorry, just another fit. Hack wheeze! Don't push yourself if you're not feeling well. Come, get some medicine from Maria. It should help you get better. No, I can get that myself. Because she got the creepy E.T. face. Sorry to worry you, I'm perfectly fine. Don't look so anxious, please. Aya, your smile keeps me going best of all. And if I can't see you smiling, it only makes me worry. Mom. Okay. Now let's get back for dinner. I made hamburger steak tonight. Your favorite, Aya. Hooray! I love Mom's hamburgers. Right, Father? Haha, -ha, of course. Her hamburgers are the best in the world. Is hamburger steak and hamburgers the same thing? Because as far as I knew, that was like two different dishes. We are so happy then. There was Maria, but... Even so, the three of us were a happy family. But then Mom passed away from illness. Unnamed illness. And the happiness we had then, well... Slow clock. Tick. Talk. Tick. Talk. Ooh. 
What? <laughs> I agree. That scream. Father? Let's go check it out. Something must have happened. I'll go check on. Let's do it. Let's go. What am I doing? I have a bad feeling. Okay, Obi-Wan, let's go. Bad news. What's this sound? Is it a voice? It's pretty creepy. Ooh. Blood brands. Heek. Ah! Music's so intense. No, I agree. I am all for no. Let's let's run. This way. Yeah, okay, do it. Don't question. Just run. Is somebody there? Yeah, okay, follow them, please. Aya? Wee. Sup, kid? Who are you? This way. Who? Stay with me. Sounds like Casper. Can I keep you? I said this way. You have a little lack of something. There's something missing? I'm not... This is really not the best choice I have. You really have no good options. <laughs> There's someone in my room. That's a good question. Who is that? Many interesting books in this room here. Do you like books, my dear? No, I just collect them for show. I really like dusting. Now don't be so aggressive. I'm merely a salesman. A salesman. In my room. At midnight. In the room of an 11-year-old. At midnight. With zombies? I don't... Call me Ogre. I hope to get to know you, young lady. Okay, you're creepy. Unless you're the ogre from Skinny Puppy and then I'm down. But it's quite troublesome to think that corpses loiter around the house. Yeah, troublesome's a soft word for that. They're like monsters from a story. Why would monsters like that? Well, it's a curse. Shut up, I am going to exposition at you. What you saw were the corpses of your father's test subjects. Overcome with anger, those deceased have been brought back by the power of a curse. To take revenge on your father, of course. What? So father's in danger? I have to save him. Why is that? Uh... To achieve his desires, he has killed so many people as part of his experiments. This is his retribution. You must have realized by now your father's true nature, and yet you wish to save him. Yeah, that is kind of a conundrum. Bye! <laughs> Peace! Got no retort! My, my. Perhaps she cannot yet understand their sorrow. <laughs> father was always kind to me. He's the only father I have. And I promised Mom, too. Flashback! Ooh, soon we'll be through the flashback stuff and I can actually start playing. Right now we're expositioning! The red-eyed stranger gave Jack the power to curse others, and Jack said, <laughs> Everyone will- I will seek my Rowenge! Hey, Mom. Yes, Aya? What's a Rowenge? What's Father always up to down below? It's a very difficult job. You'll understand when you're older, Aya. I want to be older soon, then. You'll regret that. You always do. Like, I- growing up, I'm like, I want to be grown up, and then I'm grown up, and I hate it. Aya, whatever happens, you shouldn't hate your father. Um, what's the matter? Of course I wouldn't hate father. I see. You say that now. Mom, do you not like father? No, nothing like that. I'm just like you, Aya. I love your father just as much. Whew! He can be a bit unpredictable, so let's support each other no matter what. Promise? Yeah! Now back to the story. It's such a great story. Ugh. I kind of want to know the story of the red-eyed stranger, though. And why he gave Jack power to curse people. Mom, whatever happens, I love father, so don't worry. I have to go save father. It's just her speech patterns are just very annoying. A crow? Yes. Yay! Okay, so that is the beginning of Mad Father. Uh, from here on out, I'm pretty sure that it's just um, more, play more playing than there is flashbacks. This is just a lot of exposition, but they got that shit out the way ASAP. So, uh, yeah. Um, like I said, I'm going to play this and it's kind of an experiment and some stuff might change and things like that just because uh, I'm messing around, learning some new programs and stuff to do the to put up the best possible content I can with what I have. So I hope you all enjoy it. I'm super psyched to play the game. I've heard a lot of really great stuff about it and I'm really just really into it. So I hope you remember to do all that fun YouTube stuff like like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will talk to y'all later. Bye!